Warning, this game is rated M for sexual themes and strong language. Viewer discretion advised. They're not in yet. I gotta get to them first. Hang in there, guys. I'm on my way. Hello everybody, I'm Gamester522 and welcome back to more DMC Devil May Cry. We are now on mission 11. We are more than halfway there. Living on a prayer. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, that was a perfect Trinity Smash, I love that. So then, so far our first batch of enemies is just a bunch of normal and elite Stingians. Nothing too bad. Pretty easy fight. Also my favorite song in this game playing right now. And who are you, fuck nut? Now it's time to fight a butcher. Again, we all know how to fight butchers. They're not that hard. Perfect evade and then just beat the hell out of them. And it's dead. Now, time to fight some Hell Knights and some knights. Normal knights, I mean. Let's make sure I break all their shields and get that out of the way. Here, I'm just kind of making it up as I go. That's probably what I was thinking. And finish up with trillion stabs. Damn it! They're breaking in from limbo too. All right, let's get moving. Now, I never since I don't really know what to talk about right now, so I think I'll talk about this. Um, I never really talked much about the music for this game. Where are you guys? But I love this game's music. The music of this game was done by a uh, English metal band uh, named Comic Christ, and the dubstep version of it was done by a. Hey, can you? Uh, shoot? But yeah, there's uh, the dubstep you? part of this uh, game soundtrack is done by Noisia. I love this game's music. The graffiti. Just keeping them out. Nice work, cat. Hey! Over here, saw boy! Alright, time to fight another butcher with some stingians. I pull those uh, stingians in that way to get them away from the butcher while I deal with it. As well as the butcher hitting them with its little rock wide ground saw blade throw shuriken attack thing. So here I'm just having fun, trying to manage both the Stingians and the Butcher at the same time. Missed that there, because I couldn't tell what attack he was doing because I couldn't see him. That was a horrible attempt at perfect debating, if I do say so myself. Training smash right there, that helped. I tried to do uh, another attack right there, which is stupid. Because the last thing you want to do is to get hurt by a butcher when he's pissed off. 
Alright, so now we got a Dream Runner and a Tyrant. Uh, that was bad. That was bad on my part. Since I realized that this fight might not go that well in the last one that happened in uh, Mission 8, I figured I might as well just uh, go into Devil Trigger and kill that one Dream Runner that was right there. That way, it'd be a lot easier for me to deal with just the Tyrant alone. And plus, I didn't want to take too much damage. I try to conserve life as much as possible. Come on, you gotta be dead. Yeah, there it goes. Bit of a wait period right here, which is weird. The female is right to the doors! Slashing them open. But yeah, I love this game's music. But aside from that, by the time I'm adding my voice to this video, it'll be uh, July 10th. Pat, are you there? And Stay the thing is, though, it's here. three days until my birthday. I gotta get to her first. So I'll be 22 on the 13th. So yeah. That's right, Pat. You keep them out. And I also got my and I recently got myself a Wii U. So, and I really enjoy it. I love the Wii U. Alright, time to deal with batches of enemies. Looks like we got some normal Stingians with some Harpies. I don't know where the Harpies are at. Oh, there they are. Here, I didn't even know what I was thinking when I went into Devil Trigger there. I just kind of made it up off the top of my head. That's one Harpy down. Perfect evade right there, that was nice. I really like how this mission's going so far. With regards to damage, anyway. Of course, I will admit that that last fight I did take a lot of damage against that Butcher and that Tyrant. But, overall, I think I'm doing alright right now. It's not my best run, but... To be honest, no, I don't no, even. Not now. To be honest, I don't even remember which what my best runs of missions were. But so far, the only best run I can figure right now is just the uh, the best run I can figure out right now is just that one uh, mission seven that I have recorded and uploaded. Here I'm trying to kill the uh, Bathoses, but I keep grabbing the stupid Stingians instead. Now it's just an elite Stingian. Fully charged snake guys. Now it's back to just now it's back to friggin' harpies again. I really love the perfect evade that I pulled off pulled off there. I know I'm gonna get hit trying to fight these, because if I'm just dealing with normal Stingians and Harpies, I know I'm gonna get hit. Here I try to fight this thing in like the worst spot. You'll see that in a minute. Basically, I just like slowly walk off and stuff and slide off for whatever reason. I can't just stand on it like a normal platform. So this really begins to irritate me because I don't understand what is going on. Hopefully you guys see it. And then I was like, you know what, screw it. I'm getting sick of this. Harpies need to die. So I just went ahead and killed off two of the harpies with a devil trigger. And there I go, sliding off that platform again. See, I don't, like, here I was just like, I'm getting pissed off. So I decided to just pull them all towards me, away from the stairs, because apparently the stairs are making this a lot harder than it should be. Very, 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 very live. This is another good song I really like. I really like these metal songs when I play games like this because it really makes me feel like I'm going all out. Which I'll be it whenever I look myself over at, the, at a run when I compare myself to like someone who's like maybe a place higher than me on the leaderboard or thing. And I probably didn't do so good. Got a demon evade, so 
have some fun with these Ravagers. Get another one for the hell of it. Fully charged Snake Eyes and Kapow. Gone. Alright. Now to go through this little bit of a maze here. Cat, are you here? First take a left. Oh then take God. a right. Move, move. Break a hole in this wall with Eryx. Go straight. Should Damn come it. to a divinity Can statue, then take me? a left. As well as random internet hey, disconnection for things for PSN, shitheads? but whatever. Alright, time to fight a Butcher and a Blood Rage. This one's gonna be a bit tricky. Here I was get here I knew this fight I was nervous about this fight when I started approaching these guys, because if I'm trying to deal with both a blood rage and a butcher, then that kinda makes me nervous. I get a per I get a perfect evade from the butcher, so that helps me with the uh, rage. Get a few good hits in on it. I shouldn't get my ho uh, try not to get your hopes up trying to get a perfect evade here. There's another blood rage. Luckily, there wasn't two blood rages. There are two blood rages and a butcher. I don't even know how to. I wouldn't even know how to tackle that. Butcher's being stupid, so I take advantage of that by doing as much damage to this rage as I can by, well, obviously killing it. Now I'm gonna walk up to this guy, and then he's gonna turn around, get a perfect evade, and just beat the crap out of him like normal. That's how you do it. And he's dead. And that's the last enemy of this mission. Cat. Cat. Dante. I'm here. I don't know what to do. Where's Virgil? I don't know. Uh, he's probably in the in the server room, the octagon, but he might be trapped in limbo. How do we get to him? I don't know. I'm stuck in here. Is there something I can do from limbo to break you out? Think. There may be a way. I'll guide you. And that's it for Mission 11. This is one of my more favorite missions. Because I enjoy it. Especially the beginning with the Stingians. That's always fun. Get a good 700k of style points. If I get 700k style points on any mission, that makes me happy. And there is our Triple S. So, that's it for Mission 11, and I'll see you guys next mission on Mission 12. Till then, see you then.